What's up, it's James here on James Earthbreaker again, finally stepping back into the arena, doing some Legend Balance Peeve today for you guys. You guys have been asking me, um, James, when are you going to do the next Legend Balance Peeve? James, look at your name, James Earthbreaker, when are you going to do some Balance Peeve on Earthbreaker? So today, shooting you guys up with some Legend Balance Peeve, finally. Um, my stats have actually went up since the last Hype Balance Peeve that I did back when Third Age first dropped. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys those stats. But... Before I do say that, this intro is post-recorded, so I do want to say that these matches are pretty interesting. You guys might want to stick around to the end. Uh, the video itself isn't really all that long, especially the first match. Um, it was really short because the guy decided... Well, I'm not going to spoil it, but the guy didn't decide to go through all the way with the match. But, um, getting into my stats. So, since the last video that I uploaded, Best Legend Balance in-game, my stats have went up. My damage has risen up to 89, or 98, I should say. My resistance went down to 36, but that is in sacrifice of more damage, which is comparable to Exalted damage, actually. Jordan has like 102 damage, if not a little bit more. So, 98 damage, that's pretty insane for a level 60 balance. So, um, that da that damage to resist ratio is pretty good. My accuracy is 25, so I don't really fizzle even without, um, infall. Yeah, balance's accuracy is 85, so that's actually going a little bit over. So if I get mantled, I still have that extra 5% to lean back on. So my accuracy is pretty good. Um, my critical rating is 214, block is 144, or 148. My armor piercing is 10, which is pretty insane for a legendary. Uh, my pepper percentage is 84%, and my healing in and out isn't really that good, but it gets the job done when I do crit a heal. And I actually crit on a lot of people. Even though I do have like 214 crit and that's uh, usually not seen as a lot. But it's still pretty effective. So that is the rundown for the intro. Hope you guys will enjoy the three matches ahead. Going to go ahead and get you guys in the first match. Alright guys, first match we have Andrew Iceflame. He's also a balance. So I think whoever goes first might win this one. Can we pull first? Yes. Okay, that's nice. Um, Wait. He looks like... Oh, he's an ice. Okay, <laughs> I'm really glad we pulled first then, because Ice is like super dead, um, well dead Lee at a uh, Legend, or I think he's level 80 actually, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and Tower Shield, he might go ahead and call with the wand, but just to put up the fences, and I think he Tower Shielded as well, okay, bubble control. That's a problem that I can't fix. Well, I mean, un until later on in the match, but... Yeah. Okay, we did pull an infile. He will most likely try to target my tower, so I'm gonna go ahead and infile. Because his health is a little bit too high, and I'm guessing he's level 80. So, yeah, he targets my tower. He's feeding right into the bait, and his wand is life. So, I'm not sure what exact wand that is, but we're gonna go in for a lore. Try to put some of that health down. His pet is epic, so if it does have double resist, this lore should be doing somewhere around 800, 900. Let's see how much it does. First lore of the match. Just gonna resist check him. Nine eighty-three. Okay, he has decent resist. I'm gonna guess he has either perfect ten proof or fake nine and then um defy on that pet. And the weakness, okay. Get rid of the judge. Um I'm not gonna tower or anything. Can I another infile? Um okay, delete that. Can I pull infection? That'd be nice. Savage Paw. Um, I could. He has Life Mastery, though, so I'd rather not. Um. Let's Mander. That's pretty good right now. Bro, I'm just gonna let you in. I don't have time to take this long. Okay. Don't flee! No, don't. <laughs> don't flee. I'll start discarding. I don't flee. Haha. <laughs> oh my gosh. Come on. Don't flee. <laughs> Come on. Fight. This is boring. Like, I'm wasting TC on you. At least put up a freaking fight. Oh my gosh. Come on, 
fight. Oh my god. Why are you passing? <laughs> um, okay guys, if this, if he is, as I, I guess if he's giving up, I'm just gonna go ahead and cut to the next match. So, yeah, I might not even, okay. Um, I'm just gonna discard all my cards because I guess he's giving up for real. So. No, <laughs> he gave up. <laughs> Why are you giving up, Fim? Guys, it took a while for me to get a second match, but I got one. Well, technical second match because that first guy fled. But we have Kyle Hawkeyes. Uh, I'm gonna guess he's a balance, and he's first. Yeah, he's balance. Okay, great. Um, yeah, just great. Um, okay, first round, no weakness. I could lure first round, but I risk. I I, I run the risk of tower. Is this in file? First, oh my god, okay. Yeah, that's what I'm kind of scared of. Facing balance from second. Balance to spell. He's gonna lure me now, most likely, so I need to balance to spell him and then put a lure on him. Because I do have natural peers, so yeah, this is probably... Okay, one. Perfect. I might still lose this, though. Can't really tell when you're second. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and lore. I'm not completely sure what his pet is, either. Or what his pet has on. Let's go ahead and pop this lore. Can we crit on him? Like, oh my gosh! <laughs> That's perfect! <laughs> First lore of the match, 1.8. His block must be like nothing. Yeah, he's got a veiling right now or something. That was insane. Um. Yeah, he's 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 got a veiling now. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and um I'm gonna weakness him because I think he's gonna veil right now. Yeah, a veil. Oh, what, fizz through. Okay. I mean, at first I was scared, but now I, I I don't even know who I'm going up against. Like if this is some joke or something. I don't really know, but I'm gonna go ahead and savage ball just in case he tower shields. Yeah, probably the avail. Yeah, the crit avail. If I can get the crit off on him with this, I think that's GG. Can I crit? Land? Oh my god! What? Who is this? Oh. <laughs> Why are all these matches ending so quick? Hold on, let me check his stats. That was... The shortest match. He's level C. He's he's one level under me. Oh, boots of judgment. Yeah, of course you're not gonna block. Yeah, he's got. What is your block? One. Of, oh, yeah. Dang. Yeah, that's the GG. I don't know. He 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 could have crit on me, but he did crit the avail. 81 damage. To, yeah, his resist is kind of low. His resist should be higher because he has boots of judgment on. My boots only give like five resist. Oh well. That was the second match, guys. I'm going to go for a third match. I think I'm trying to make this... Well, I'm going to try to make this third match a little bit longer. Because uh, I think this video is kind of short. Because the first guy fled and this guy just got crit on all up and down. So, um, yeah. GG.
Kyle Hawkeyes, and I'll get you guys in the third match. All right, guys, third match, third and final match. We have another balance. Gavin Dragon Hunter. Okay, can we pull first? Because I think this is another balance. Okay. Um. Yeah, he's a balance. Ah, uh, balances from second. Come on. Okay, delete that. Um. Discard the stun block. I don't think I'll need it. TC lore. Weakness. Let's go with that. Okay, I think he might be a level 90. Because he's got Poseidon boots. <laughs> so this might be a little strug. Uh, do I want to enchant the Savage Ball? Um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and enchant the Savage Ball. Can I pull an Infall right now? That'd be super sweet. Um, let's card that. Infall? Doom. Um, I'm going to Mender. Because this guy can crit on me. I think those Poseidon boots give crit, if I'm not mistaken. And he's got, I think, a Poseidon hat on. Not too sure. His pet might be failed, so that's good. He shouldn't have that much damage. But he does have an Eye of the Suits there, so I'm hoping he's not level 100 with, like, um, Hades dungeon gear. So, I mean, let's enchant the Scorpion. And see what we can do about bringing him down. Another week. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm going to go weak him again. And then I'll see about Savage Paw into Lore Master. Just to get his health down some, because he does have a lot of health. Okay, yeah, this is what I was afraid of. High-powered spells. Don't crit. Okay, good. Okay, 7 hunch. It's not bad, but his health is still high as, like, all hell. Okay, we're getting the elemental sets, so he can't Spectral Blast, which he might have in his deck. <laughs> right, perfect. We pulled um, Balance the Spell. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and give him a Savage Point to Lore Master, because our Mander is giving us a Blade. So. I shouldn't need to infile either, because um, I have Natural Pierce, and I have, like, Exalted Damage, so... I shouldn't need to, because his gear doesn't give that much resist to balance. Okay, what is this? The blade? Okay, setting to spiritual schools again. Or actually, the Sabertooth alone gives may cast. Um. Wow, that did a lot. Does he have no resist? Or like, t t okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and give him the Lore Master. His best bet would be to, um, I mean, shield of some kind. I'm getting another blade. Mander's coming through. I might Scorpion next. So we'll see what I can do then. Shield or weakness? Don't be a balanced spell, please. Okay, wand. Okay, yeah, see, spectral, okay. So yeah, Mander was definitely a good idea. He's got decent damage, actually, if his attacks are hitting like that through um, a weakness or a TC weakness and um, an ice tower shield, basically. Yeah, Lore Master. It's 1.9 with two blades. It's pretty much, or it's almost a critical. Okay. Um. Can't really do much right now, but he has failed pipping. That's kind of bad. I'm gonna go ahead and weakness him. And I just realized I failed pip as well. So if I can pull a savage from um, side, I can finish this. I mean, if this isn't like a weakness or something. Elemental trap, okay. If I can get a critical off, that'll be good. Okay, um, I'm gonna, I'm going to, actually no, I have a blade on, so can I infall right now? Okay, pull the savage. Um, 
Infallible, please. Infa, there we go. Tower? Okay, I didn't... I guess I didn't really need the uh, Infallible then. Well, yeah, this is pretty much the GG. These matches went fairly quick. I'm surprised, actually. Oh, I failed Pip again? Um... Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and give him the TC Lore Master then. Since I failed Pip again. That luck. Tower Shield? Nope. Oh, okay. Um, was that helping or availing? I'm pretty sure that was helping. I didn't see his pips though, but yeah, this is GG. Go ahead and give it to him. It's a good match. E block. Yeah, it's pretty much fair because I have like high damage and. I'm gonna go ahead and check his stats after this, actually. Just to see. And he was first, so. Okay. Um, stat check. Okay, so he was 82. 44 damage. Yeah, he had no resist, like, whatsoever. Well, like, he had two resist to me, because I have 10. 9 pierce, that's not bad. He just, he had almost as much pierce. Okay, yeah, he's definitely blocking me, so his, his gear does give extra block to balance. Um, and he had good critical, so... I don't normally PvP. Yeah, I see. Poseidon's... Wild Wing Tunic. That gives a lot of peers. Poseidon's... He has... He actually has decent gear. Like, if his pet had proof and defy, he'd be, like, pretty good. His stats would be pretty good. But yeah, GG Gavin. Um... I'm going to call that the video for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I have stuff to do after this, projects mainly. Uh, I've been staying home due to um, a foot injury that I have. So I've mainly been staying home and recording videos for you guys. So um, in the comment section below, let me know what you guys want to see next. Whether that be Fire Peeve, um, I can do some Ice Legend, I can do some more Balance. Um, or I can try to do Mythic Zill, if you guys want to see that. I have a pretty good strat down on my myth. I've been um, trying to test out, but I'm going to have to get Jordan to help me out with that. See how it works against balances, because I, I don't really have like a fire friend to test it out on. But yeah, that is the video for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Comment and sub for more P from me. This is James giving you guys a sign out. See you guys next PvP video. Peace out!